Hey Jim, so just to elaborate on a very controversial thing you said on live television today about <laughs> how you need to boil your mushrooms. Yeah, it's okay. So we were on the Today Show and a lot of comments started coming in about how boiling mushrooms is not the right thing to do. And that's cool. I like, I like to have a little bit of a challenge um, because then we can change the way people do things. But yeah, I've got mushrooms in the pan and that's just water boiling around them. And these are wild mushrooms. They tend to have a little bit more water than even store-bought, but you can do this with any type of mushroom. And the thing is, I can I can keep going with this for days and days and days while I cut up more mushrooms and put them in the water. And I can do as many mushrooms as I want. The thing is, I'll just keep adding water as I go. What's happening there is that the water from the mushrooms is being cooked out of the mushroom. And where you would typically start off with fat or oil or butter, the thing is... The okay. Yeah, so this is basically almost evaporated off. I would like to cook the mushrooms just a little bit more, but you can see that that, that stock's already caramelizing a bit at the edges. Um, but I'd like to add a little bit more water and let this cook for another two or three minutes just to make sure that I got everything in there cooked perfectly. So I'm only just going to add just a small amount more. How do you know when it's going to Well, cook? I know just by years of experience and looking, but uh, you would pick this up like pasta and see if it's al dente, you know, and see yeah. if it's got a good bite to it. If it's got too much of a chew, then put in some more water and let it cook a little bit longer. You see that small amount of water I just added in? It's not bringing any more water out. So I'm quite happy now to know that they're all pretty much perfectly in balance, so I'll go ahead and put the oil in now. As soon as that water's evaporated off in about 30 seconds. Alright. Cool, so all the water's evaporated off, it's now dry and sizzling. I'm just going to add a bit of uh, olive oil, not much there. And I'll go ahead and put my aromat stuff in. If I were going to put in like woody herbs, this is a bit of shallot and garlic. And yeah, now I'm frying and cooking the outside of the mushroom. And they're all intact, they'll never go to mush. And this this is like a 30 minute to one minute process after that. Smells so good.